Hi friends, this is Manis Pandey. Welcome back. In this video, you will see how to disable or hide marketplace tab in UiPath Assistant. In the previous video, you learned about how to install the automations from marketplace and how to run that one. Let me show you how to disable this tab. So let's launch UiPath Assistant. Now it's connected. Now you can see this is the tab. This is marketplace tab. Sometime this marketplace is not useful for us. This is not useful for me. I want to hide this tab. I just want to see this home tab and this reminder tab. So how can I do that? So for that we have to create a policy in automation ops and then we have to apply that policy for this UiPath assistant. So let me open UiPath orchestrator and left side here you can see dot 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 that is more option click on this and click on this automation ops now click on this governance and then here we have policies click on this policies click on this add product policy so currently i do not have any policy applied so click on this add product policy select this assistant because i want to create a policy for assistant only and this policy will hide the marketplace tab from UiPath assistant here we need to write that a specific policy name so I am going to write like disable market place and select this click on add now you can see here the policy name is this and this is the availability days this is the priority the first priority and this is the description where you can write something like disable marketplace tab from UiPath assistant now scroll down allow custom widgets use official fits but currently we are going to look at only marketplace you can see a second number UiPath marketplace widget and the version is 2.0.3 now click on this edit this there is a checkbox here is enabled so if this is checked it means marketplace tab will be appeared on your UiPath assistant if this is unchecked you will not able to see that so let's uncheck this click on save now you can just make sure this should be no is enabled should be no for UiPath marketplace widget now click on save now this is the policy where we have just updated against this assistant product so now we have created a policy to disable marketplace tab from UiPath assistant now this is the time to deploy this policy to the UiPath products so for this we have a tab that is deployment click on this and here policy can be deployed at three levels of granularity that is by tenant label group label and users so tenant groups users so we'll go with tenant because I don't have any group I don't have any users so I will go with tenants and then here you can see the tenant name click on this edit here you can see the license type attended RPA developer automation developer studio web citizen developer unattended robot so you can see for unattended robot will not able to see this UI path assistant so we will not able to apply this policy citizen developer we have that but basically I'm not using citizen developer for a studio wave this is just for a studio wave we are not using that automation developer we have this RPA developer we have this attended we have this one now based on our license type we need to apply that so you you can also go to this admin click on this licenses and then you can see here we have the license that is attended and automation developer right so we'll just go back to the automation ops click on this deployment click on this edit 
so basically I'm using this automation developer license type so I'll click on this and then from this section assistant I will click on this select this disable marketplace policy and then click on save now this policy has been saved and applied to this tenant label now you can see currently it is not disappeared so just to refresh this policy we have to click on this from tray right click on this UI path assistant logo click on refresh policy and you can see as soon as you will click on refresh policy you will see the marketplace tab is now disappeared from UI path assistant so based on the license type you can apply that policy and you can hide that tab I hope this is useful. If so, please like this video and please subscribe this channel. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to learn Blue Prism, please visit my YouTube channel youtube.com slash Blue Prism RPA. And also, if you want to learn Blue Prism from Udemy and you want to get certificate, you can search for my Blue Prism course there. That is Blue Prism RPA complete course. I will also put the link in, in my video description. You can go through that there. Thank you.